हेलो एवरीवन टुडे नाउ वी विल डिस्कस सम मोर क्वेश्चंस रिगार्डिंग इंडियन एंड इंटरनेशनल नंबर वैल्यू सिस्टम स्टूडेंट्स यू हैव टू मेक नोटबुक फॉर दिस मैथ सम्स दिस इज इजी फॉर यू ओके वी विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम 1.1 लेट्स सी क्वेश्चन नंबर 2 ऑफ एक्सरसाइज 1.1 In this question, number name is given. You have to convert number name into numeral. So, as you know, place value table, lakh is there. So we will use Indian number system. We will write in short form: ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakhs, ten lakh, seventy-three lakh. What uh what is the place value of seventy three lakh? So seventy three will come down. Seventy three lakh. It will come below ten lakh and lakh. Next is seventy five thousand. Seventy five is related to thousand family. So it will come here seventy five thousand. Three hundred. What is the place value of three hundred? So three will come down hundred, then seven. But we we have two places here, and there is only one number. So this number will come below ones place. Now there is no number for tens place. So we will write zero. Now we will put commas here and here. That is seventy three lakh seventy five thousand. Three hundred seven. Now we will take next example. Here is million, and million will come in international place value system. So we will draw here international place value system. Once tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million, ten million, and hundred million. Fifty eight million. Here is no hundred, so we will not use hundred million. So where fifty eight will come? It will come below ten million and million. Fifty eight million four hundred twenty three thousand. It is related to thousand family. So four hundred twenty three thousand two hundred two. Place value of two is hundred two hundred two. There is no number of tens place, so we will write zero. Now write down commas like this. That is fifty eight million four hundred twenty three thousand two hundred two. Now we will do question one of exercise one point one. For this, I will tell you one method. You have to write both. Place value tables: ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, ten lakh, crore, ten crore. This is Indian system. Now we will write international place value table: ones, tens, hundred. Thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million, ten million, hundred million. We have to write both tables in sequence. Like once if here, then once. Tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, hundred thousand, ten lakh, million. Crore ten million, ten crore hundred million. Now, if we have to move from ones to tens, the then we will add one zero. If we have to move from tens to hundred, then we will add to one zero. Like ten hundred. If you if we have to move from hundred. Two lakh. So how many zeros we will add? 
lakh in lakh there is there are five zeros so how many zeros we will add three zeros How three zeros will come? One, two, three. So three zeros will come. In international place value table, we will use same procedure. If we have to move from hundred to tens, we will add one zero. From tens to hundred, we will add again one zero. Now, come on the question. Question is one lakh is equal to dash. Ten thousand. Like in lakh, five zeros are there. So in hundred thousand, also five zero will come. In ten lakh, six zeros. Then in million, also six zeros. They have same values. Now come on the question. In one lakh, how many ten thousands are? There. Now both place ta uh, table values have same values. Now in one lakh is equal to dash ten thousand. Lakh is there. Ten thousand is there. When we will move from ten thousand to lakh, so there is. One zero. We will add one zero. So one lakh is equal to ten ten thousand. Both uh, tables have same values. In hundred million, there are there are eight zeros. Then in ten crore also there are eight zeros. Now we will take another example. One million is equal to dash lakh. Now, million is an in international system and lakh is an in Indian system. But as we know, that lakh and hundred ten thousand have same values, so we will consider hundred ten thousand as lakh. When we will move from hundred ten thousand to million, we will add one zero. Okay, so in one million, how many ten lakhs are there? Ten, because lakh. Is equal to hundred ten thousand. So one million is equal to ten lakh. That is considered as hundred ten thousand because they have same values. Now we will start with word problems. In exercise one point two, there is question number two. Shaker is a famous cricketer. He scored six thousand nine hundred eighty runs. He wishes to complete ten thousand runs. How many more runs does he need? He scored six thousand nine hundred eighty run, and he wants to complete ten thousand run. So what we will do? We will find difference between these runs. Let uh, take one uh, another example. Let us assume that you have rupees twenty, and you want to buy a toy. The cost of that toy toy is rupees eighty. So how much more money you need? That is the difference between these two amounts, eighty minus twenty. It means you need sixty rupees. Then you can buy that toy. Similarly, in this question, if he wants to complete ten thousand run, then he have to subtract ten thousand minus six thousand nine hundred eighty. That runs he need more to complete the ten thousand runs. So for that. We will make statement. Runs scored by Shaker six thousand nine hundred eighty. Runs he wishes to complete. That is ten thousand runs. He need more. This ten thousand minus six thousand nine hundred eighty. We will subtract it. 
So how many runs he need to complete 10,000? 3,020. Now pause this video and write down these questions in your notebook and solve them. After solving third question, you have to learn this Roman numerals. Thank you.